Uh, so I just got through installing Webmin on my uh, Linux computer. As you can see, this is Ubuntu. Um, Ubuntu 16.04, I believe. Uh, this today is 05.18.2016. Uh, I tried installing Webmin on my PC. As you can see, there's an option for it. There's a ton of instructions as well, but for some reason, it would not install. Uh, as you can see, I'm trying to load um, load this on my uh, virtual private server. And uh, yeah, so what you need to do is to load this up on a uh, Linux. Uh, let's go ahead and power up Linux. And once you're logged in, you open up Firefox. And next up, you want to go to the webmin.com website. Copy the uh, first section for the installing. Uh, this is going to grab the file of the webmin program from their uh, server and install it onto your desktop. You hit enter, it run the program, and begin installing. As you can see, it's going to show you the speed and the uh, current <laughs> installing time. All right, so what you this is I already have it installed. Uh, what you want to do once you have it installed is take it from your downloads or wherever you have it installed and drag it to your desktop. Uh, make sure it has the same name file. Don't change the name file. Just leave it as it was. Uh, once you have it installed, you open up terminal again. And this time you want to go into super user. So that's sudo space su. Uh, to go into super user, you have to type in your password. And don't worry about your password not showing up. Um, this is just part of Linux. So once you have uh, the super user, you want to go into your desktop. And to get into your desktop, that's cd space desktop. Enter. Now on your, your desktop, you're where the file is. You're directly connected to the file now. Uh, skip section two, all right? Because this and this is for Ubuntu. I don't know if this is for every other Linux, but uh, for Ubuntu, skip section two and go to uh, section three. If not, you're gonna run into issues. Um, that it's just gonna fail. The install is gonna fail, and you have to do this anyway. So whatever just uh, go ahead and install this part except it's gonna take a while all right so once you have that installed you're all set you uh, click on the link It's gonna provide you this link right here it's gonna be your desktop name and uh, to the um, just click on the link all right, and then this come up, it's probably gonna be blocked for some reason telling you that it's uh, it's security, this and that. Just accept, accept, and then voila, you're in. And now you can sign into your host or your SSH or whatever and set up your uh, server. All right, thanks for watching.